about, I don't know, six foot, I guess. And uh, you, you might as well get your, your wooden stakes, crucifix, your clove of garlic, load your guns with silver fuck bullets, because you're going vampire. Got it. And seriously, what was that outfit? It was a magician, but it was like also a vampire? I don't know. Whoever did this is still out there. Caucasian, male, seriously, a vampire. Who the hell's Buffy when we need her? No, no, no. Not that kind of party, Mr. Dracula. Yeah. The kind is not appreciated here. I need you to vanish. Can you do that? Hey, psycho! Son of a... I'll let you in if you give me eternal life. If not, move on, buddy. Find another way. Do we have a description of who we're looking for? White guy, no hair, bald. He made those fruity-ass TV vampires look like a bunch of whining pussies. Okay, I'll check it out. I, I can't see him! I know that vampires are everywhere these days, so that's what we're looking for, I guess. Uh, maniac vampire. Whoa, Vlad the Impaler? <laughs> Whatever, man, look, you can... Forget about walking through here, you damn creature of the night. Uh-huh, right. And I'm really a werewolf, but my whole wolf pack is waiting to tear you up. Seriously, get the hell out of here, you goddamn prankster. I ate lots of garlic, smell this. And vanish, you creature of the dark. We're definitely emo or goth, or some other disturbed subcultural dropout. Whoa, hello, Mr. Vampire. Pretty cool outfit, man. Halloween? So soon? Is there any form of fiction more overplayed right now than a goddamn vampire? Got a big old crucifix here to shove up your ass. Come on, man, do a trick. Oh, yeah, anything goes. Go on. Someone sneaking around? No big deal. No wonder the country's going to the crapper. What, do you think this is a joke? Whatever, I don't care. You're not coming through here, vampire. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did Pierre set you up for this? <laughs> That's funny. Tell him that I know vampires aren't real. And it's been years since I believed that shit, so get out of here. <laughs> Pierre's such an asshole. Scram. And I don't know if he was in some emo band or something. Maybe he was hey, just a hey, vampire. Hey, hey. I don't know what that disguise was all about, but he looked like some kind of blood-sucking vampire. Hello? We got an armed suspect, white, bald guy, stone face, like, mm. and he looked like your average vampire. Nothing special about that. White guy, no hair, bald, and seriously, a vampire. You heard me, dressed as a fucking vampire. Crazy hat, cape, and fangs, man. A vampire. Hey, stop. Why are you strangling that person, man? What's wrong with you? White guy, big, tall, bald. And he must be a really funny guy. Posing as a stupid you vampire. Think you're getting away. He was a vampire, I'm telling you. White, bald, and he had this, uh, uh, this, this elf thing going on. Or maybe it was like a leprechaun. I'm on it. I'd say around six feet. And yes, you can laugh now. He was dressed as some crazy vampire. A hat, and crazy glasses, and the phony fangs. Go punch holes in him with a wood stake, please. How could you? Pretty tall, medium build, and he looked like one Let of those Twilight it. kids. A vampire thing, anyway. Oh, someone's messing about. What can I say? Small Caucasian, medium build, I say around six foot. And besides him being a vampire, nothing was out of the ordinary. Yeah, you heard it. A vampire. 